Hey, what up Z Clan and everybody else? How you doing? I hope you all doing good. Welcome to my Fallout 76 before you buy video. So in this video we're gonna take a look at the Robber Halloween bundle. So let's stop wasting time and jump right into it. Alright, so before I jump into reviewing the entire bundle's items and outfits, etc., I'd like to let you know what was the selling point towards me. And the selling point that made me buy this bundle was the Plasma Ball Set. And there is a big reason for it, and I'm going to review this item the first, because it has the most, the biggest value well, as the way I see it. And I'll explain it in a bit. But essentially, this uh, entire bundle, it has the rubber costume and the Under Armour. So I assume the you can wear the same outfit and Under Armour. But it don't look good. I mean, I don't like it. It wasn't a biggest selling point for me. Uh, the Jail Wall Kit, it, it looks cool, right? Uh, but once again, it's it wasn't the biggest selling point for me as well. Although it's good to have, you know, you can always make something pretty cool. Uh, so I would say like it's also a good addition to the bundle. The outfit, yeah. Uh, then the lights, the lights are always good. I like when my camp is all shiny on stuff like that. Like combine it with icicles and stuff like that. It's, it could make your camp look like bright with different colors which is pretty cool and I'm definitely gonna show that in a sec then we got some more decorations I believe these are the wall sort of like stickers and stuff like that so uh, yeah it's good for uh, those who like to like put a lot of different decors and make like specific Halloween uh, themed camps plus if you have uh, purchased other Halloween camp uh, bundles in the past they also have different stickers so like well wall decoration let's call it wall decoration you can make a pretty cool decent like build right of your camp dedicated to Halloween stuff and obviously the plasma ball set which we're gonna review right now alright so let's begin now why this item is a selling point for me well first of all it's located in the floor decor as you can see there we go and there are two variants, a small one and a big one. So for instance, uh, nah. anyway, let's just put it here. So I put one here and I put one like, let's say here, for example, I'm going to rebuild my camp in whatever case and like one over here. And as you can see the budget and there's no limitations on how many of these things you can place. Uh, during the night, these things actually also like sort of projectiles so on other camps. And it's another sort of source of light. As you can see, it's projecting over there. So, this thing is freaking beautiful because now uh, you can have a more shiny camp. The thing is. I was, I thought, you know, since this is the light source, right, it should end, it, it might gonna end up in the light section, which means we have a limitation of 50 light stuff that we can build, right? So I was like, man, no bother. But then uh, one of the Z Clan members, whenever this thing first came out, I think that was two weeks ago, told me, bro, it's in the floor decor. I'm like, hold on a second. If it's in the floor decor, that means it should not calculate from the budget, right? So look, if, if, you, can, if you pay attention, I got 44 light out of 50 uh, uh, placed right now. And if I go back to the floor decor and build one more, for example, right? So let's just drop it here, whatever, don't matter. And go back to the light section. Uh, where's the light section? Am I blind? Hello? There you go. 44 out of 50 so you, pretty much you can place a lot of these things like wherever you want and I think they, they should even look cool with like there you go look at it man I, I, I'm the ideas right now in my head is just like bow, 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 bow. <laughs> so man I am super happy that and Z Clan Thank you for the feedback in the comments when this thing first came out and for those who bought it and actually mentioned it because I would wait for the discounts to buy it and you know but 
now I decided, man, no discount. Let's go because this is cool. I have, I'm going to be building a new camp, I think, today once the double XP ends and once I finish working. Uh, yeah, I'm going to make a bigger wall and I think I'm going to stay in the same uh, location because a lot of Z Clan members moved into this area. And it would really suck if I just go and pick up and leave. Because, <laughs> you know, it takes hours to build a good camp. But anyway, so, uh, man, this this thing right here was the selling point for me why I got this bundle and I'm like extremely super happy that I got it plus another uh, um, youtuber uh, Vlad uh, he's on Xbox he made a really epic camp and uh, he's gonna share it on our discord when he's when it's ready so check it out we saw it yesterday on the stream it was, it was a blast uh, yeah but I'm gonna also link his uh, on a I think, oh uh, yeah, yeah, he does do YouTube. I, th I was thinking he's just doing Twitch. Sorry, there's just so many content creators out there. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to share uh, the link to his channel as well. And telling you that camp is going to blow you up your mind, man. My Hot Topic camps don't stand even near to that thing. <laughs> what he built. But anyway, so uh, let's move on to the next. Uh, and we're going to do the outfit. The rubber, 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 rubber costume. <laughs> Alright, so essentially to make the outfit, you will need to navigate to your armor workbench and uh, in order to make the current set, first of all there's an under armor, second of all there's an outfit and I believe there's a head aware. So uh, you go to your under armors over here, scroll all the way down to your W letter, you find the wasteland bandit under armor, you make it and you have it. Afterwards you navigate to your outfits uh, and again you scroll all the way down to the W letter, right? And there you go. They're pretty much the same thing. It's just one of them is the actual costume, the other one is the under armor. Afterwards, you navigate to your head aware and pretty much do the same thing. Go to your W, and you should find what we should find: the cap and the mask. Oh, the mask is separate. That's cool. <laughs> Yeah, some brilliant, brilliant uh, combo ideas are now popping in my head. Popping in my head. <laughs> Sorry, I'm in a good mood today. Alright, so we go with the costume, with the mask, and with the Wastelander Bandit thing. And we've removed the backpack so you can clearly see how the outfit looks like. And I extra and I become overweight. And as you can see, the body go is getting darker. The light is going kicking in. Look at that. Light is kicking in. It becomes even more shiny. <laughs> yeah, boy. <laughs> I love it. Alright, so there we go. Uh, that's the outfit. I do apologize that it's not that bright, but let me do it this way. Boom. So that's the outfit. Nothing too fancy. I mean, there are definitely way better outfits out there, but it's still pretty cool. Imagine having a, an entire uh, public server running around in the same outfit. Like, a jailbreak server, man. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's remove that uh, m cap over there. See how the mess look like. Oh, that looks nice. That looks nice. Gotta tell you. Gotta tell you. I'm pretty sure a, a lot of different uh, hats will look good with it. Yes, sir. Or play like a superhero or something. Roll up. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, so uh, the costume. Here we go. So that's the Under Armour. That's the costume. So I always assume that it's going to work exactly the same. I mean, it's going to look exactly the same, but all I need is to take out my gear so you can see it. It pretty much looks identical, I believe. Uh, let me put that waster costume back on. Yeah, it's identical. So, yep, that is identical, and I like to put this stuff back on. Bam, 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 bam. All right, cool. Oh, look at that, bro! The mummy helmet looks good with this outfit. <laughs> the mummy prisoner, man. But I still like my caravan trader outfit. That caravan trader outfit, a lot of you've been asking, and I started using it a lot because it actually it looks really, really nice. So the next time it pops on the uh, Atomic Shop, I would definitely recommend you to buy it, and it's definitely gonna have a discount because this outfit, man, I've been rolling it with a lot of different masks, and it just looks so freaking cool. 
that, that you cannot hide. All right, so let me get rid of this, this, and that, and that is the end for uh, the review of the Bandit Under Armour and stuff like that. Uh, what else do we have? The jail set wall. Let's go and take a look how that looks like. Alright, so right now we're going to be taking a look at the jail cell wall. So we got the door and we got the actual wall. So uh, that is located in your walls uh, section, right? And instead of me building those somewhere, I'm just going to replace them with over here. So, bam, replace, bam, uh, replace, bam, replace, Bam. Replace. Bam. And let's do this one replace as a wall. I mean, as the entrance. Bam. So there we go. Looks good. Looks really nice. I mean, it's good to have. You can definitely create some decent camps if, we, if you put your imagination into work. But yeah. Looks pretty nice. What else do we have? Uh, a decoration uh, set of three. Let's go and take a look at that one. All right, so decorations uh, are located at the wall decor. So we got the ghost over here. We've got the ha 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 skeleton, and we've got the flying witch. Which, by the way, in another bundle, there's a flying witch as a player icon, <laughs> which is pretty interesting. So as I said, other uh, Halloween bundles also included other wall decorations such as the black cat, the uh, that that fly o I mean uh, fly low <laughs> the bat, so the pumpkin and stuff like that. So you might want to check out all the other things. So yeah, if you put uh, like different combinations, you can actually make a decent stuff. But uh, in this bundle, what is included? is the ghost, the ha 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 skeleton, and the witch. So that's what's included within this bundle. Lol, I was so excited about those plasma balls, I almost forgot about this uh, light. So uh, you can find this in the light section. And where you can find it is uh, at the wall, uh, sort of the, the lights that you stick on the wall. I don't know why the hell they're there, but OK. and. It seems like these things are like for the actual wall and not like the ceiling because as you can see you can't even place it. So I thought it, it was supposed to be like somewhere with like like the, the those cage lights over there or the icicles, right? But it turns out it's a little bit different story of, of, of what it is. So it's not actually a ceiling wall uh, decoration, it's actually a wall decoration. So there you go. And if we go back to the bats, it's not going to work. It's actually the wall decor thing, which is kind of interesting. And now I wonder how much light does it generate. And of course, have in mind that since these are located in your light section, uh, they drain uh, your light budget. So at the moment, and there's a bug, or it's the game is a bit slow. I have no re and uh, like it takes like a minute for it to react that I actually built something. So for now it shows for me that it's 49 out of 50, but in reality I already hit my budget because you can see I have exceeded exceeded the, the maximum build count. So that means 50 out of 50. You see, there you go. Now it changed. So kind of weird stuff going on with this game, man. Uh, but anyway, that's turns out it's a little bit different than what I thought it was. A uh, good bonus, but then again, this right here is the selling point for me. Alright Z-Clan and everybody else, I hope you enjoyed this video and found it useful. And if you did, you know the drill. Don't forget to hit that like, comment down below. Please make sure not to use profanity as those comments get triggered by YouTube. Nobody see them, nobody can read them, nobody can react to them. So if you want your comments to be read and viewed and replied to, please uh, do not swear. You can always provide your positive or negative feedback in the proper manner, right? And if you're new and you subscribe, welcome to Z-Clan. I'm Gamer Z Soul from Ukraine, so I have from Ukraine. And uh, once again, I hope you found this video useful and uh, it helped you with your decision whether if you want this bundle or not. I actually recommend it just because of those plasma balls. Those are like the, the top thing from this bundle. Well, that's my personal uh, viewpoint. Uh, maybe those bats that stick on the wall are also good. Uh, I'll need to test them out and see how, what I can, what magic I can do with them. But they kind of look more like 
childish. You know? It, you know what I mean, right? And I want to make an epic, like, cool, good looking, like, camp, you know? But man, anyway, those plasma balls are the best. That's it. <laughs> That's my closure. <laughs> And uh, feel free to drop your comments down below as well. Would you recommend this bundle? Would you not recommend this bundle? Would you like? Would you dislike about it? And so on and so forth. As many feedback as we can get, the more feedback we can get, the the better choices other people will be able to make in order to neither get this bundle or not to get this bundle. Uh, but yeah, this is pretty much it. Once again, I hope you enjoyed the show. Join our Discord. Uh, we talk about Fallout 76 there all the time. Like... Uh, we have a lot of different chats, events, share screenshots, camp building, uh, protection against griefers and stuff like that. And more, more things are coming. We're over 750 members over there. But most importantly, read our rules for the overall Discord rules and read our rules for the trade chats. Because if you break any of those, you will get banned. And there is no unbanning procedure. So read them. Alright? <laughs> and I'll see you all on the next video. So thanks all for watching. You all have a good morning, day, and night. Whatever you guys like it at. And I'll see you on the next video. Bye. From the